Hi everybody! I am here with uh, my July digital paper collection and this one is pretty special to me. Um, it was um, inspired by unknowingly by my big sis June Angel Pews. Hi sis! And um, she just loves the ballet and um, there are just so many awesomely beautiful vintage ballerina images um, that um, I found a few that I wanted to work with and so I titled this one Ballet and Blooms Collection and I stayed in the same format that I usually do where you get one yeah, that has like the theme of the design on one paper um, and then it has a complementing page that's more of a background page. And I'm super excited that the Elegant Embellishments design team will be using this collection uh, for their July design team projects. And um, I will put links to um, the, their store and the design team members down below in the description box. And before I show them to you, I just wanted to remind you uh, when you go to my Artfire store, Artfire unfortunately does not have the ability for me to set it up for you to instantly download after you pay. Um, I do get notification that an order has been placed, and when I get the notification from PayPal um, that it has been paid for, then um, within 24 hours, I email it to you and it usually does take at least more than one email to get all the files to you if you order the full collection. Um, but I mean generally it's usually within 12 hours um, but you know just in case I'm super tied up at work and um, maybe need to sleep or something silly like that. <laughs> That's why I say within 24 hours but it's generally within 12 hours or less um, that I do email it and um, you are able to print them as many times as you want. Um, any images that I use from the from the internet um, I do make sure that they're royalty free. I actually do my searches for royalty free images um, and uh, public domain images um, so there's no issue with that. Um, you know, I've, I certainly don't want to get in, into any trouble in that area. So um, I know a couple of people have contacted me, you know, asking me, you know, just to verify that. So just to make it clear, so you all know, and uh, in in my Artfire store, you do have the option. There's one section for digital paper collections where you can buy full collections, and then there's another section where you can buy um, single sheets. Um, so let me go ahead and show it to you. This is the cut sheet that has all the designs as two inch squares and the only way to get this sheet is when you purchase the entire collection. So but that, that's good to print out and keep in a binder so that, so that you have a reference um, when you buy the collection so that you don't necessarily have to print all the pages at once yeah, just put it in a binder and then you can flip through and see what you have and print out what you need. So this is the first image. And I just love that ballerina. And this is the complimenting background page. And you can fussy cut out the ballerinas, you can fussy cut out the flowers, use them as they are and embellish them. There's definitely a lot of options. I just love that one. I love them all. I'm a little partial, but... <laughs> I 
And this one on your screen is probably going to look, um, the background will look more yellow, but it, it prints as kind of a light tan. Almost like a peachy tan. I love this one too. This has, um, has some lacy doily edging all around the border. It's almost like lace, uh, lace curtains while she's taking her bow. And this one, you may recognize this ballerina from um, when I did the my ATCs for Patsy. So like I said, you, you can purchase individual pages if you want to, um, or the entire collection. And the entire collection also includes the inches and dominoes of the designs. You can also purchase this sheet individually if you want to. And also the tags. two pages of tags included with the full collection or you can buy the full set of tags. So that is the July digital collection. Super excited to see what these design team is going to do with it and hope you all like it and um, I'm actually gifting this one to June since she was the inspiration for it. Thank you, sis. I hope you like it. And um, I will put all the links down below. And um, for those of you who don't know, um, I, I do have a Spare Marbles page on Facebook. Um, yeah, you know, I'm just just starting to use it some, and I'm sure activity on there will go further. Um, so you can just look up Spare Marbles on Facebook and um, yeah, hope you'll uh, get a chance to follow me there also. So thank you all so much for watching. Thank you so much for all your kind comments and, and, and support of, um, of what I do here digitally. I really do have a lot of fun with them. Um, it's probably what I'm most comfortable with as far as doing any kind of crafting is doing things on the computer. Um, <laughs> yeah, I, I, I do other types of crafting, as you all know, and I really, really enjoy it, but I'm definitely stretching myself and going out of my comfort zone in almost every every other type of crafting that I do. So. <laughs> um, but again, thank you all so much for watching. Hope you're doing well. Hope everybody has a wonderful and safe July 4th holiday. Which speaking speaking of which, um, the shop my shop will be closed July third, four, five, six, seven through the seventh, and it'll be open again on the eighth. Um, gonna go spend a little time down in Tennessee, so um, enjoy your July fourth holiday, and thanks so much for watching. Till I see you next time, take care. Bye bye.